Hi, I'm Mingi Jung from Darwin's College. I'm very happy to join Ocean's 2020 student poster competition. Now I present. Today, I'm gonna to talk about optimized design for research-oriented autonomous surface vehicle. In response to climate and environmental changes, scientists are increasingly deploying ASVs to collect data and monitor marine ecosystems. systems. However, current approaches to develop the ASBs focuses on seaworthiness, maneuverability, and autonomous system and control, which does not include quantitative analysis between design and sensing quality. This can evaluate expensive expeditions because of sensors' poor reliability. Therefore, our research goal is to propose a novel optimized design and systematic evaluations with the quantitative metrics for research-oriented ASB. Based on the prototype design with all the essential components, our design space was circumscribed to the location of motors and sensors. These are the main underwater components for a surface vehicle. The design space was determined by considering draft, trim, hill, stability, proportion, and more. The following evaluation scheme will show how we validate the sensor interference and make a decision on the design space. With the full ASP setup, we conducted a matching 3D model and actual robot by hydrostatic tests, including static stability and fundamental parameters during the simulation and the pull test. With this method, in case of future design shift, the resultant model equilibrium can be predicted by cross-checking. Also, by using computation of fluid dynamics, we tested sensor interference caused by discharge of waters from direct interactions with motor locations. We proposed new quantitative metrics for the sensor interference. First, pitch and heap. This is to minimize the motion's amplitude and equilibrium time, which would overall minimize negative effects on the sensor readings. The other metrics were turbulent kinetic energy and velocity magnitude. In addition, we checked quantitatively streamlines depending on the design. To validate the simulation experiment carried out with the CFD, we conducted a field test to make a decision on the motor positions under dynamic environment at Barbados. By using customized PWM signal, we qualitatively and quantitatively checked. First, the qualitative image by ASP's underwater camera and diver camera show that position four is ideal because of their clean and sharp with the less cavitation effect caused by motors. Then we quantitatively analyzed pitch and depth measurement by sonar during this experiment. Among all motor positions, position four also showed that least pitch angle on average as well as its variations. For the sonar measurement, position four also showed the least amount of, of uh, overshooting data and invalid numbers. Based on the confirmed motor design space, we tested the design shift at Lake Sanapi in New Hampshire for new installation of water quality sensor. Using the quantitative measurement based on chlorophyll sensor, we found out the vertical configuration as a set of two has less interference than horizontal set of one. This test validated the modular decision of design space on research-oriented ASB. Even with the optimized design, as you can see from the sonar, the collected data might still have some fluctuation issue, which will be our future research direction. In conclusion, this work presents optimized design of a research-oriented ASB in terms of motion efficiency and in water sensitive quality. In addition to a first new systematic validation scheme, we propose a quantitative metrics such as trim, pitch, velocity magnitude, and turbulence. We can expand the evaluation of a new design criterion such as sensor reliability for general research-oriented ASV development. We can also apply the practical consideration of the design space by some features such as hill stability and structures. In the future, we'll develop optimizing control algorithm as well as adaptive paths to minimize the additional sensor noise. As a long-term goal, we'll improve our method into more automated computation algorithm for multiple deployment of ASPs. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any inquiries, feel free to visit our website and leave us an email. Thank you.